Welcome back to Resident Evil Revelations 2. The Overseer just set off the alarm or something like that and now we've got a horde of monsters coming at us. He's luring those things right toward us. But that's not fair! What do we do? We'll try to speed up the job. Somebody kill that goddamn siren. Alright, we'll take care of it. It's coming from the bar. Oh, I know exactly where that, that is. Fixed. Oh! Go, 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 go. Good use out of this pistol. That's it, right? We chased him away. No, didn't you just hear the screaming? Hold on. Can I go through the window? Or oh. Okay. That's not what I'm looking at right now. Oh god. There's no effing way we're gonna beat that thing. Run, Moira! Run! Oof! Rescuing partners. Partner character will go down if they run out of health. Once down, they will not be able to move. Save it down, partner. Press tab while in close range. Well, I think I'm, like, pretty much down myself. Hold on! Don't come dying on me! <laughs> hmm, so Moira said there's no way we can take that thing. I don't know if they're just being... Hyperbolic, or if I need to actually run. I could try running. Maybe I'll try running. Alright, where are we going to start from? Is it right when the boss happened, or... Yep, okay. 
Oh. Oh, we can't leave. We can't even go out the window. Oh, here we go. Okay, we're not going that way. What's our goal right now? Just kill it? Is there some environmental thing I can use to kill it? Oh, it's coming. Moira is behind me. I see a flashlight. Uh oh. Moira, this way, hurry! Come on, come on. On the back and open the door. Hang tight. I wish I knew you couldn't defeat that thing, because then I wouldn't have wasted all my explosive bottles. It's unlocked. Go! Bullet hole? I hope so. Wait, Neil. What about Gabe? I know, but we can't risk staying here. Look, don't worry. He's ex-military. The man eats danger for breakfast and craps it out by dinner. Too much information. Ready? Gabe said you guys got split up. Yeah, but I run fast. Gym membership. So, uh, what was that monster back there? It was Pedro. The Overseer gave us all some kind of viral injection. The virus triggered in Pedro when he got too scared. I think I've heard of that. A virus that responds to fear. Jesus. We're supposed to be protecting people from viruses, not catching them. <laughs> Irony sure is a dick. Moira, I don't think you actually met Neil. He's our boss. Neil Fisher. You're Barry Burton's girl, right? Your dad's in the BSAA? Do me a favor, and don't put Barry and me in the same sentence. Sir. Why does it only show up when the flashlight's over it? The heck? thing. Like a collectible. Uh oh. 
I just made a decoy bottle. You okay there? Vibrating. <laughs> Pedro said the signal came from high up. That's got to be it. That tower thing. Yes, the, the tower thing. Might be inside. I say we go find out. Uh, bad idea. We should wait for dawn. By dawn, we might all end up like Pedro. The clock's ticking, Neil. I think this is the most open space I've been in before. Now we get to really look for all those collectibles. Bet you there's something underneath this. Damn it. It's too strong. Oh! Oh! Oh, no, 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 no! Bad doggies. No, poor things. Christ, they're horrifying. Well, since we're gonna encounter enemies here, I should probably do some crafting. Oh, I don't have any empty bottles left. Never mind. So, what do we got? One exploding bottle, three decoys, and a firebomb. Very weak. Is this where we're supposed to go? Ooh. I think so. Scary noises. So, let's check out over here. Or maybe there is no over here. Oh yeah, there is no over here. I think maybe I can Ah dang it, it's just it's just not the same as evil within two, is it? I'm trying to bust out of somewhere. That didn't do what I thought it would. There we go. It's supposed to get their attention though, isn't it? Doesn't seem to be doing a very good job of that.
<laughs> All right. Um. Okay. There's much more there. Hurry up. They're gonna bust through and he's gonna get eaten or something. Come on! I promise I'll catch up. Just get to that tower. Come on, you freaks! Catch me if you can! Wait, I can combine it. Okay, make a disinfectant. Cl cleans away gunk. I don't know what that's for, but I guess I'll make it. Maybe that's important later on. Got a double. Hopefully I find a workbench soon. Ooh. I think I see a pump action shotgun on the wall. Oh, big one. I hear breathing. No, get up on it. I'm super low on ammo. Eight shotgun, four handgun, that's it. Oh, 
Do I need the box to get that? Seriously? Claire, you know your arms can reach up, right? One nine four. So obviously it holds more ammo before reloading. I'm I'm guessing because of how I mean this is Resident Evil. It's super gamey. I'm guessing it does less damage, but I'll have to check it at a workbench. If it does the same damage, then I think it's just strictly better. A chance for stealth. Also, I can't get back up the stairs. Okay. Mm. Wait, don't. Isn't there not a stealth kill for these? I thought there wasn't. Didn't I try this before? Oh. Maybe I just did it wrong before. Alright, that just saved a ton of ammo. Um, let me clear them all out before I explore this area, huh? Oh, it's another big one. Small one over there, big one this way. Is it gonna keep coming? No, it's turning around. Oh shit. Shit. Maybe if I don't shoot it, the do the uh, other swan here. I'm sorry, doggy. All right, they didn't hear. another dog over there. Should be pretty much okay.
I love finding bips. That's it. Ah, oh, I can only make another decoy bottle. All right. Who's that? Oh, that's a little kid. It's that girl. Yeah, we saw her in the prison. She has a bracelet. You think she's part of the experiment? If the Overseer is trying to scare little kids too, then that is seriously messed up. All this other stuff they did is forgivable, but for that they're going to hell. Fleshy noises. Behind this door. That looks like a boomer. I think I want to customize this, so I think I'm going to get rid of the two-shotter. Only... I don't know how. Maybe you can't. Well, I'll just switch him then. So number two is... The better shotgun. No. That might be the thing that covers you in gunk that the disinfectant's for. Oh. Moira, I think you're gonna be seen. Investment in the evade is definitely worth it. 50% more ground covered.
Ew. Bad noises. Hope nothing comes down from there. Combine that with the bottle to make an explosive one, right? Oh, firebomb, right. Mock experiment results, 8th of November, 9, uh, 2009, the latest mock moved us even closer to the real test. This time, 11 candidates were fitted with the sensor bracelets and subjected to extreme emotional stress for varying lengths of time. Results, three died immediately. The remaining eight eventually mutated at some point and were disposed of. The trial ended with none of the subs overcoming their fear. That one was pretty well hidden. Now I gotta look under all the beds. Kidding. Uh, I guess we gotta do it again. <laughs> It's not possible for you to stay there, but it's also not possible for you to come here? What does it mean? I don't understand, Claire. It might be a valid tactic to actually get close to them so that they start to explode and then just run. Maybe save some ammo that way.
Little kid. I'm guessing the door is locked. Oh. Door isn't locked, then what's back here? Wait, I can't go back? What? Okay. Alrighty then. Okay, I should have a bunch of upgrades. Scatter, capacity. Scatter. That doesn't sound like a good thing. So, let's take a look. Yeah, the damage is significantly less. 490 compared to 700. Hmm, but then again, this thing is upgraded. I forgot, can you take them out? Because it's... Oh, X to remove. So, 630 is the default. Let's put some damage in and see how it turns out. 533. Hmm. I mean, I guess it's not that good. The fire rate is significantly slower and it does significantly less damage. The only advantage is that it holds more rounds. I think I'd rather go with a more powerful gun, actually. Uh, let's see what some of these other ones are. So, improve ammo capacity and parts for shotguns to expand the blast area, making it easier to hit multiple enemies. I don't think I want that. Then again... Actually, that might be good for crowd control, huh? Maybe that's how I'll use the shotguns. Because I get the feeling... Let's look at the crosshairs. Uh, the same, they have the same crosshairs, so I'm assuming they have the same accuracy. So let's save them the uh, one that does more damage for like bosses and stuff, where we just want pure damage. And I'll use this one with greater capacity and I'll put scatter on it to make it more for crowd control. Scatter and... I guess fire rate would be good too. Yeah. And then for this one I'll put the damage back on it. Prove ammo capacity? Can I make a tube rail shotgun hold three shots? And quick load. My poor pistol's got, like, nothing on it. What did I just- oh my god. My two-barrel shotgun literally holds three rounds. What?! I mean, who cares about realism, really, right? But... what? Well, now it's definitely better than the other gun. Uh, let me switch him again. Just gotta remember the arcane key combination. We go to T, we press Q. Um, eh? Yes. Now, two is the one we want. Yes. Cool. Actually, I still want to change it. Uh, I think I want this on number four. There we go. So, one's pistol. Two is the shotgun we usually want, three is the shotgun we want least often, and this is the machine pistol on number four. Okay. Where'd she run off to? Lots of doors.
lots of blood. Town residence memo, written in Russian. Things have changed so much since she came here. Or however you pronounce it, it's almost like a completely different island now. There's new equipment in the mines, and the jobs. Not just laborers, but she's employing people as researchers as well. There are so many employment opportunities. I cannot express my gratitude to her deeply enough. Despite this, there are those who doubt her. Such ingrates. If you don't like it, you're always free to leave this place. Ah! Need there be something in the mailboxes? Any shinies? So we're gonna get the drill at some point, obviously. Is this thing actually working? Of course. See what's in that box. Quick load, level two. Let's put that on the shotgun. And we'll put the other quick load on the pistol. What was that? I thought I just saw something. Aha, I did. You tricky little... Oh, you have to get it from up there, don't you? There's no way I can aim at it. Unless... Unless... Decoy bottle? Um... I don't know, will it go through? Ah! <laughs> the little guy thing said it would go through. Oh, whatever. You win, game. Wait! It's okay. Don't be scared. <laughs> don't worry about the explosion. Where are you from? Did that lady put you here? Where are Whoa, you? down, Claire. Let me talk to her. You must be so scared. I know I am. My name's Moira. See? We're like sisters. Everything's okay now. What's your friend's name? Lottie. You're both so brave. You're pretty good with kids. Come on. Okay. So you managed to stay away from the monsters all by yourself? Uh-huh. You're a brave girl, but this will all be over soon. 
Listen, there's a bad lady in the tower out there. Once we take her out, we can all leave the island together. Did you hear that? Yeah, another one of those walking shit stains. Sorry, I mean butt stains. And you know what we do to butt stains. <laughs> oh my god. <sighs> ah, I love this dialogue, it's amazing. Sauce? That'd be a yes. Thought we would have had a chance for stealth there. Yes, it is. So it throws fire. Yep. Oh. I get the impression they just keep coming. Oh, I thought maybe that was like a weakness. Like you had to shoot it when it was on fire. Uh, I guess not. I think the checkpoint is from right before the boss fight, right? Like, yeah, before even when it went down there. Okay, well, I think we'll end this episode here. So I hope you've enjoyed so far. And when I return, I'm going to take on that boss. Which is actually, I think, the first boss we've fought in this game so far.